2010? Yeah, I've been doing music since 2010, especially in my church. And I'm happy because it has been a very, very fine moment for me. Mm. Yeah. Uh, tell us about it, because you were able to do like a whole album. Yeah, 2010, I tried my best. I did my first album, unfortunately. Mm. The team that I was with, or the people who were surrounding me, they were not able maybe to support, mm. because I was somebody there with a different idea, you know, being one person with different idea among people who have different different ideas mm. so it was very challenging for me mm. i tried my level best but i could not make it so i was forced to go down fast and wait mm. for the right time because right god, time. god's time is the best time god's time is uh, the best time yeah do you feel do you feel like uh, at the time it, it, it was rushed the whole process uh, no or was it just the management's uh, the different issue, ideas? The issue was that uh. I had a dream uh -huh. that I could do it. Unfortunately, the people I was working with, they, didn't, they could not see that dream before. Yeah. So I can't say it was a rush idea or it, I was faster than my time. Mm. No. Uh, no, I can't say that. Yeah. yeah. So, okay, the first album didn't do as well, but then you, you didn't uh, lose hope. You yeah. went back to the church. Then you became a motivational speaker. Yeah, I've been doing a lot in, from my church through the support of Pastor Bill Gdinji. Uh, and from which church, if I may ask? Deliverance Church, Solid Rock. Solid Rock. Yeah. Okay, shout out. Osalimi. Now, shukuru wote. Mungu wabariki hamjamboni. Yeah. Okay. Mm. So how did that start? Did you always have a passion? Did you always feel like uh, yeah, you're a shepherd? <laughs> because a motivational speaker is like a shepherd in yeah. church terms, yeah? Yeah. Did you always have that calling? Actually, even if I refuse, I usually find myself doing it. Mm. Because sometimes you find a kajama there who needs your support. You know, sometimes being a motivation speaker does not mean you are trained. It's something that is spiritual because mm. you find somebody there who needs your support. Through that level, you are a motivation speaker. You can train this person of which class you are supposed to be in. Maybe because of ABCD, this happened, but you can change it. Mm. The way you are, you can change it and improve your life. Mm. So it has been well. Yeah. Uh, we need a word, actually. You know, I think these days, if did you talk to Nazasimo Kweli, uh, we're flooded by music that is not actually guiding people to the right direction. So what would you advise the youth of today, the people who are watching you, Circuit, uh, people from Solid Rock who are watching you right now, what would you tell them right now? To me, I can say, these people are saying that many music may be at a fake level. Yeah. I can say this. There's so many, 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 many music outside there that are very good. Unfortunately, the challenge becomes to how we are marketing our music. You find that the music that we are doing, those who are doing quality music, it's not easy for you to get a chance like, now Nixon is at Y254. It's not easier. But those who are maybe doing these other things, inakuwa ni raisi kwao kuenda juu. So we need to pray more. Those who are doing gospel music, we need to pray more. Those who are doing secular music still, we need to pray more. Because we can also do this secular music with a good message. Mm. Yeah. Ah, I like that. Uh, they would call it love music. Yeah. Instead of just secular music. Because even their gospel artists, like uh, Kina BBC Winans, they sing love music. Yeah. And uh, Simba, I mm. think uh, even our parents can listen to it without cringing. Yeah. Would you do that? As a gospel musician in Kenya? It depends what you are doing. Yeah. I don't say I can't do it, mm. and I don't say I can do it, <laughs> but it depends with what you are doing. You know, sometimes it doesn't uh. mean when I sing song and mention God somewhere, it's mm. a gospel music. Yes. So it depends deep On from you, me, what am I doing? Whom, who, whom am I speaking to? Yeah. What am I trying to pass out, mm. to pass to somebody? Mm. So that is what matters a lot. Yeah. Uh, tell us about your comeback in the music industry after 2010. Because right now we have a new track that we're about to uh, uh, release on the East Circuit. But before that, let us know. Ulipata uh, Motisha Kurudi. I've been praying. Yeah. Every time Nauduria Keshas, every time Nauduria events the church, na feel too like Nilikosea. 
mm. because unaketi pale and you have something that is unique yeah. through that prayer nika believe ya kwamba in 2018 i must do something mm. that's why last year niliamka nikasema i'm going back to the studio mm. yeah i'm going back to the studio because wanasema hata ukiona simba amenyeshewa usidhani ni paka so this year kwamba it was my right time to go back yeah yeah so fika bisa which studio did you go to which studio did you uh, choose i want to thank mr abedi ngoso <laughs> because he's a very good friend of mine and he has been a friend of mine for so long so nilikuwa kila saa tukikutana tunaongea ananiambia kuja kwa studio ufanye mambo mm. tukienda mahali ananiambia nixon you can do better than what you are doing now yeah. so come back to the studio we do something good so i did it and mm. i thank a bedding also wherever you are may god bless you gamba mm. production yeah gamba yeah. production yeah fun fact before we go to the new track which is uh, same again yeah yeah uh, Uh, your first album you paid for it uh through football yeah and people don't know this about you i bet even solid rock are uh, about this uh, they don't know about that very <laughs> few people knows about this someone like uh, ventures whatever he is someone like alex kavaji whatever you are he, yeah. they knew about it because they were there very supportive yeah. and they used to give me very serious support unfortunately they are no, they were not to that level where they could say nixon now utatembea hivi ufike hapa mm. tulikuwa tunaingia tu kwa studio tunafanya tukimaliza <laughs> tunaenda uh. but we thank god we mm. thank god because god had a good plan for me yeah yeah ndio akasema tulia utaamka tena utaamka tena yeah. na ndio umeamka umekuja na track kali sana same yeah. again what's the inspiration behind same again this same again i know it can minister to anyone anytime any uh, it doesn't matter about your age mm. this is a song where it once you are in trouble once you are in very difficult situation i believe it can minister to you it doesn't matter your age or your category mm. even the rich people they sometimes find themselves in a very critical condition in yeah. a very difficult moment this song can minister to them mm. yeah Nice nice. Uh before we go, I want to read uh, some comments on Facebook, Twitter and Instagram. That's on White for for channel Ama the East Circuit. But I have a question for you. Mm. Uh our topic of the day it's about dreadlocks and the high school kids. Apparently they've been allowed to go back to school with dreadlocks. What do you think about that? <laughs> As a motivational speaker and a gospel uh, artist. Uh, to me I can say this. It's good to follow the rules that are any place mm. follow the rules mm. but you, now that's the new rule uh, uh, go with dreadlocks <laughs> once you come to my I'm um, a teacher mm. in my class i say please i require only students without tuseme nataka wote wakuwe na long whether you are a lady or you are a man kindly follow that rule mm. if you feel like uh, my rules are very unsuitable for you just go to somewhere else mm. where these rules will suit you where the rules are more acceptable to you yeah you found a way not to answer i, get, I see where the motivational speaker comes in <laughs> uh, where can someone find you on social media yeah uh, in social media i am nixon amadi amadi uh, n i x o n that is my nixon nixon mm. amadi mm. you can find me there on twitter facebook instagram and that's all and youtube of course they can subscribe yes. nixon amadi mm. the best support you can give me is by subscribing to my channel mm. yeah. yes so subscribe subscribe wherever you are <laughs> so so we're about to play nixon amadi's new song same again uh, but before that let me sample some of your tweets and comments on facebook uh, someone by the name of arian simba goes by the handle arian underscore simba on twitter and i said thanks white for for channel for playing tamu by mboso You can thank DJ Talk and you can still send your request on Azingoje or VP. Yeah, yeah. Kabisa. Yes. Sa sa. Uh, on Facebook Iman James and I say I'm loving the show kindly play for me Kiboko by Masauti. I don't know that one by like in DJ Talk or Nigeria. Mm. Yeah, mm. yeah. So if Kabisa David P is it Peace or Prince? David Prince and I say uh, play for me in Goma Moja and Nandi Amanyash free locked. Huh? Nyash I'm a nyash I'm a free 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 nyash I'm a oh I'm a free nyash even though I'm going to manage to say so so I'm a lot from Eldoret thank you for watching